Korkut is a recent Turkish low-altitude air defense system. It was designed to replace the aging M42A1 duster systems of the Turkish Armed Forces. Its main role is to protect mobile combat units against various air threats. Production contract for the self-propelled anti-aircraft gun, SPAG, was signed in 2016. First serial Korkut systems were delivered in 2019. The Korkut is jointly produced by Aselsan and FNSS. Though production numbers are rather humble. By 2020 only 13 of these systems were delivered to the Turkish Armed Forces. This Turkish artillery system saw action in Libya. The Korkut was designed to protect mechanized troops and mobile combat units, as well as key installations against various air threats. It can be used against hostile helicopters, UAVs and ground attack aircraft. It can also engage air to ground missiles and cruise missiles. The Korkut also has a secondary capability against various ground targets and infantry in buildings. It can easily destroy most lightly armored vehicles, such as armored personnel carriers, most infantry fighting vehicles, self-propelled artillery systems, trucks, and so on. The Korkut has an unmanned turret, armed with two Erlikon KDC-0235 mm cannons. These are licensed produced in Turkey by MKEK. Guns are fully stabilized, so this SPAG can fire on the move. It can use conventional 35mm ammunition, as well as airburst ammunition, which is also produced by Aselsan. The use of airburst ammunition significantly improves effectiveness of this system. Maximum range of fire is 4 km. Maximum rate of fire is 550 rounds per minute for a single gun. This air defense system uses a linkless ammunition feed mechanism. It allows to load two different types of ammunition at the same time. It takes less than 15 seconds to change the type of ammunition being fired. A total of 400 rounds of ammunition are carried for both guns. The Korkut uses a tracking radar and electro-optical sensors including TV camera, thermal camera, and laser rangefinder to detect and track the air targets. The Korkut is based on an ACVAD, also known as ACV-30, armored track chassis, provided by FNSS. It resembles that of the US Bradley IFV. Its armor provides protection for the crew against small arms fire and artillery shell splinters. There is an NBC protection system for the crew. This SPAAG is operated by a crew of three or four. Vehicle is powered by a diesel engine, developing around 600 horsepower. It is mated to an automatic transmission. There is an auxiliary power unit, which powers all systems when the main engine is turned off. This combat vehicle is fully amphibious. On water it is propelled by two water jets. A battery includes three Korkut self-propelled anti-aircraft vehicles and Korkut KKA command and control vehicle with integrated search radar. This command vehicle is based on the same FNSS ACVAD tracked armored chassis. It can detect air targets at a range of up to 70 kilometers. It has an integrated friend or foe identification system and coordinates operation with higher echelon air defense units.